Hello friends and welcome to my channel Organetic. It's that time of the season when we have to put away all the summer clothes and shoes until next year to free up the space for the cold weather clothes. In today's video I will share 7 ways to store summer clothes that can save space. If you like videos about home organization, please subscribe to my channel and let's get started. This first method I use myself all the time. Let me demonstrate it with my summer pants that I usually keep on hangers in the closet. We are going to need a wardrobe trunk or any large box for this. To store pants I put the box on its side and stack the pants on top of each other. Once the box is full, put it away in the closet. As you can see, thanks to the vertical storage method it's easy to find the pair of pants that I need. I bet you have a suitcase at home. If you don't use it often and only need it when you go on vacation, then why not take advantage of this large organizer for seasonal clothes storage? To protect clothes from dust you can take big plastic bags and put clothes in them straight out of the closet. If you do it carefully preserving the shape of stacks like in this example, then when the cold weather is over all the stacks can be moved back to their original storage places. It doesn't take much effort at all. However, if you suddenly need the suitcase, take the bags out and put them in the place of the suitcase. After the trip, put the bags back inside. One of my favorite ways to store seasonal clothes is in the so-called storage case. It's a big organizer with a handle on the side to make it easy to pull it out. It also has mesh inserts in the corners for air circulation to keep the clothes fresh. This case can be placed literally anywhere. I personally keep it at the very bottom of the closet, which isn't the most convenient place for daily use, but it's great for storing seasonal clothes. Of course, you can keep this case anywhere in the house, whether it's a top cabinet in the hallway or a place under the bed. You can also keep it in the pantry, in a garage or a shed. The best way to save space when storing clothes is to compress them in vacuum bags. Not only do they reduce the volume of clothes for storage, but the bags also protect your clothes from dust, moth and odor, as well as keep the contents dry. Of course, it's best to use them only when you really need to save space. If you use a vacuum bag, you have to open it every six months and allow the clothes to breathe a little. Then compress them back in the bag and make sure to only do that to clothes made of soft and low maintenance fabric that can handle the vacuum environment. If you store your summer clothes on hangers in the closet, then you'll find this next idea especially useful. By the way, thin velvet hangers are already a good option for saving space. Select the things you want to store. You can sort them by color or by type. Next, bundle everything together by tying up the hooks with a hair bun or a rope. Put the bundle in the garment bag. If there is enough space on the bar, hang the bundle and push it to the side by the wall. If not, carefully fold it in a roll and put it away in its temporary storage place. The next idea is for storing small summer items like swimsuits, tank tops and t-shirts. We will use shoe boxes for this, which happen to be the best free organizers that everybody has at their disposal. For good hygiene measures, it's best to choose clean and quality shoe boxes and even better if they are brand new. To navigate the contents easier, you can make labels out of stickers or sticky notes. Fabric bag organizers with compartments are great for storing summer shoes. Summer shoes typically don't take up that much space and can fit there perfectly. Obviously, before putting shoes away in the bag, they have to be cleaned, dried and repaired if needed. Using the organizers to get your shoes out of the way will make your hallway feel more spacious. 
if you want to see more ideas for shoe storage, watch one of my most recent videos. As usual, I leave the link in the description box below. If you like this video, please show it to me by hitting the like button. Please subscribe to my channel if you are new. See you next week. Bye-bye!